like he's left the red to the middle. It's all gone wrong for Gilbert since losing that frame to needing a snooker. But a couple of kisses there didn't do Ryan Day any favours. Well, it's a good pot. Not a great safety from Day, really, to leave that on. One more loose red then, and then it's going to be about the split. All those fouls though, they've made a difference. Ryan Day, uh, there's only probably two reds in this frame, but he's still in front. Because he got all those foul points. So this is a key shot coming up for Dave Gilbert in this third frame into the Reds. But as long as that Red isn't now blocking the path of the one he's closest to to the middle, not sure 
could be unlucky here. Or can he get through to the second one? Well, it looks like he can. Yep, so he's uh, banging business here. Just got to finish the job now, which uh, he failed to do in the previous frame, of course. When Day got that snooker. Without all those foul points, he'd be 56 in front right now. A couple of balls from winning the frame, but he's only 20 in front here. He's not there yet, even though the Reds are all out in the middle of the table. Good pot. Struck it well. So Gilbert looking good to pull one back. Green and brown for a century. Of course, he was behind that green for a long time trying to hit the reds. Missed nine times. 99. But he's had the last lap in this frame. Been a really good break, this. So Dave Gilbert emphatically wins his first frame of this final with a clearance of 121 and it's going.